Howdy, Raid here. Welcome back to an all new video. And today I got to talk about Roblox's war on scammers. My friends, Roblox is finally taking the steps to just come back at scammers because you know, there's just so many on the website. I mean, let me just name a few scams off the top of my head. We got adopt me scams. We've got free Robux scams that aren't only on Roblox, but they're also on YouTube. Then we got account scams where people send you suspicious links and kids press on them losing their accounts. Those are just a few that I could name off the top of my head. There are just so many more. And it's actually really, really cool to finally see Roblox just doing something against scams. Now, before we get any further into to the video, YouTube tells me that a lot of people that watch my videos are not subscribed. So if you enjoy daily Roblox commentaries, please hit that subscribe button as it would really help out. And if you don't like the videos, you can unsubscribe at any time. Other than that, let's get right into the video. Basically, Roblox has this problem with scams. You know, I got some off the top of my head at the start of the video, but you guys are all probably wondering, Raid, what kind of scams are Roblox combating against? Like, what is this war on scams that Roblox is beginning? Are they finally getting at those pesky adopt me scams? No, my friends, Roblox is kind of going for uh, link scams, like, you know, forum links, people on the forums would just post random links that could steal your account and they're educating players about security. Now let's talk about Roblox and suspicious links. Basically, there are just people on Roblox who send suspicious links and kids press on them. And when they do that, the hacker or whatever gets their Roblox security token and is able to basically log into the kid's Roblox account. After that, the hacker can do whatever they want and the kids basically lose an account that they spent a lot of time and money on. I don't exactly know how these Roblox link scams work. You know, I'm not a hacker. I'm not out here scamming seven-year-old children. I just make commentary videos. But what Roblox is doing is actually pretty nice. Basically, the RTC tweeted, News, this new screen comes up when someone clicks on a scam link on the forums. And in that tweet, an image was attached, and that image was on the Roblox Education or Forum website where it says, Whoa, hold on, you just typed in a link that could have been a scam. If this was a real scam, you would have fallen for it. Scammers and bad actors. Wait, 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 Roblox. Why are y'all talking about bad actors? Like, bro. This ain't a movie, this is goddamn roblox.com. This isn't theater. But yeah, scammers and bad actors often use fake websites to trick people. Never enter a website into your browser unless it's official. As you're online, remember these tips to spot unreliable websites. Be wary of transactions of real life money or gifts like free Robux, people asking you for account or personal information, or links to unofficial websites or websites that have common and then it you know, continues with some security tips. Now, people on Twitter were actually pretty happy about this. Someone said, damn, Roblox is getting better about handling thing. And then somebody else said, finally, Roblox. Roblox is making their moderation system more good, yay. Not really their moderation is, you know, having improvements, but it's more of just their war on scammers. It's just they're teaching the community to not be absolute idiots. Now, Roblox moderation hasn't improved in any way. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's still garbage. But yeah, that's kind of the first thing that Roblox has done. But the second thing is now they're actually trying to educate the community, not only on these like link scams, but on a lot of other stuff like account security. Basically, Roblox has made this place called the Digital Safety Scavenger Hunt. Let me just drop in the trailer for it right now. Personally, I think this looks pretty cool. I think it's nice to see that younger players are getting an opportunity to learn about like account security from Roblox directly. But the thing is, how is Roblox going to advertise this to players? Like, I think what they should do is when new players are signing up, like they should say, hey, yo, check this place out. It would really help you out. It's a fun game that you can learn, you know, account security on. Digital safety is important. And I think it's especially important on Roblox where there's just tons of children playing. And the thing is that, you know, tons of people can be on Roblox. So you've got a young audience, but you've also got some real weird people. I mean, let's face it, Herbert the Pervert probably plays Roblox. And a lot of people like him do too, and try to, you know, steal stuff from kids or actually do weird stuff with kids or probably steal their accounts too while they're at it. What I'm trying to say is that people are messed up on the internet. And if you're a young user watching this, you know, try to not get into that type of stuff. So yeah, Roblox is doing this against scammers 
and teaching people about security. It's so nice that this is finally coming at such, you know, great scale. Roblox usually hasn't done something this big. You know, we got some account tips here and there, like don't give away your password or anything. Admins won't ever ask for your password. But now Roblox is actually trying to take this on, and I feel like this war has only begun. Now, with Roblox doing this, it doesn't mean that scammers are just gonna goddamn disappear into thin air. There are still so many of them out there, and I think Roblox has to take the necessary steps to stop them. Now, personally, I don't know much about Roblox Adopt Me scams, but if it's the biggest game, I think Roblox can straight up work with the developers to do something about it. But with Roblox suspicious links, Roblox is working against that. I mean, we can clearly see them teaching kids so a lot of accounts can be stolen less now that that's happening but people are still out here past guessing i mean even kaneko kitten they talked about this in a video roblox really needs a better two-factor authentication system and with all these billions of dollars roblox can straight up pour let's say a few million not even a few million maybe just like a mil into security because it would really really help out the platform so yeah roblox instead of making goddamn arthro packages give some people some better account security give us a better two-factor authentication roblox even needs a better verification system to prove that you're not a bot like soda lost her account a while ago and she was trying to get back in with the verification system but it really didn't let her she spent like a good 45 minutes sitting there trying to get her account back all of this frustrates me because Roblox has so much potential, but at the same time, they're slowly killing their website. So yeah, this is really all I gotta say for the video. Roblox's war on scammers has begun, and Roblox is definitely gonna hit a few more punches at the scammers. Also, shout out to my only channel member, Bowserman. If you're watching this video, shout out to you. Thank you for the support. Basically, if you press that join button down below, starting at $2 a month, you can support my channel and get exclusive perks like shout outs at the end of the video. So yeah, shout out to Bowserman, and it has been Raid, and I'll see you all in the next one.